There are few techniques which I will be describing to improve your lung function. Before entering to these techniques, there are few common instructions which you have to follow. The first instruction would be your always inhale through your nose and exhale through your mouth. In each exercises, you need to hold for 5 seconds or 5 counts. And there will be hand placements in different lobes. In such a way, you have to feel the lung expansion and recoil. These are the three instructions which you have to follow while doing this breathing exercise. The first breathing exercise would be the apical breathing exercise. Place your hands crossed. Place it below your collarbone. This would be your apical breathing exercise. The second one would be your lateral breathing exercise. Place your hand on your lateral chest wall. This would be your lateral breathing exercise. The third one would be your diaphragmatic breathing exercise. Place your hand just below the chest wall, almost close to your abdomen. So these are the three breathing techniques which you have to follow with the instructions what I have told before. The next technique would be your thoracic expansion exercise. There are three thoracic expansion exercises and here too you have to follow some of the few instructions for all the thoracic expansion exercises. The first one would be your always inhale through the nose and exhale through your mouth. The second one would be hold for 5 seconds. The third one is quite important. Each arm movement has to coordinate with your breathing pattern. Okay, let's get into this thoracic expansion exercise. First exercise would be try to rise your arm up. This would be the first exercise. The second one would be your This is your second thoracic expansion exercise. The third one would be your horizontal. Put your arms horizontal. So these are the three thoracic expansion exercises in order to improve your thoracic mobility. So let's get into the third technique which is your positioning. I would be explaining three positionings. So one will be in lying and one will be in sitting and the third one will be in standing. All these positions it's good to follow that to improve your air entry into the lungs and to stop maximum using of your accessory muscles. So first in lying position, I would be suggesting the best position is lying on your tummy. The second quite important position is you can lie on your back but make sure your head end or your upper end is elevated a bit almost around 30 to 45 degrees. So the next thing sitting. In sitting where you can find the table in front of you so you can put your arms resting on the table make sure the shoulders are relaxed and try to bend forward and put your forehead on your hand. Okay 
So this would be the best position in sitting. Now let's get into the standing position. So when you are in a standing position, you see you can use the same table wherein you can put your hands on the table and gently lean forward. So these are the best positions which will improve your air entry to the lungs. So these are the key points which you have to follow regularly. All these previous exercises, whatever which you have been told, it's good to do it four times your day in each exercises 10 repetitions. So thank you all 